acceleration, braking, and steering within the lane all happen with a level of smoothness that human chauffeurs would struggle to match. Steer at all or touch the pedals, and the system surrenders control to you instantly, acknowledging this with a screen message and reverting from the green to white lighting around the cluster. If your traffic jam involves an obstruction in your lane, the system will signal in for you to resume control because it is not programmed to perform lane changes. You'll also get this signal as soon as the speed of traffic ahead exceeds 37 miles per hour, if visibility degrades markedly, or if the road's limited access is ending. This signaling involves a message on the screen, a tone, and red lighting around the cluster. If you fail to resume control, the system tries to rouse you with more insistent tones, a sharp cinching of the belt, and a couple stabs of the brake, after which it assumes you have passed out, so it stops in the lane, sets the parking brake, unlocks the doors, turns on the flashers, and calls for help. Trust me, no healthy person will sleep through this. Don't grab your MX black card and head for the dealership quite yet, TJP will launch in Germany as soon as EU regulations are amended to make it legal there. It will roll out to other countries thereafter, and although there are few legislative hurdles to clear in the US. Audi is still testing the system on our unique roadways and fine-tuning liability countermeasures such as the onboard event data recorder. But the company is confident that this 4th Gen A8 will offer TJ.